Welcome to Real Life. I hope you're having a great day. Today's episode is a wonderful reel. Francois Arsenault spends a lot of his time living in the past. The Vernon videographer and historian has amassed quite a collection of classic black and white film that he converts to video which he posts on his YouTube page, Real Life. But Arsenault is always looking for more and right now he has his sight set on the holy grail of classic footage. In particular, I'm, what I'm really looking for is 16 millimeter and potentially 8 millimeter film shot back in the late 1930s at the Vernon military camp. I know it exists. I saw it briefly in a documentary about 20, 20 years ago, and it would be exciting, absolutely exciting, to be able to see that film footage of the British Columbia Dragoons training on horseback back in the 1930s. Uh, of course, it would be something that the museum would love to see, and I think that people here in the Okanagan would re really be quite excited to see that, especially given the uh, amount of traffic we've had on some of the local films. When it comes to saving these films, Arsino is passionate about what he does. I have found these films quite literally all over, uh, all over the world. Fundamentally, these films are important because it's somebody, it's somebody that did this. Somebody went to the trouble of taking this, this footage. It meant something to them at that time. So I think it's important to preserve that. For Castanet News, I'm Darren Hatchie. In Vernon.